Hi everyone, how are you? Today I was thinking that I, I want to uh, share some new beginner steps in pole. Have you ever heard about pole? <laughs> well, it's, it's a kind of um, sports where many people have misinterpreted um, the use of pole because some people think whenever they heard about pole, so people think about the more exotic or people or sexy ladies who um, go to bars and something like that. But I'm talking a different pole in another way. So many people actually have been into sports and the pole organization internationally, they are fighting for it to to make it uh, in for, for the Olympics. Isn't that great? By the way, so if you are planning to learn some pole, uh, I can share some beginner steps and I have written some five steps, the simple ones. Anyway, this pole right here is just connected through a rubber up there. And also there's another way how to, to make it spin. This one is, right now it is static. And I can also make, if I rotate here, then this is now spinning. So if, if I, for example, use it in a, uh, if I want to spin a bit longer, the spinning mode will help it. Otherwise, I can make it static first. Then you won't rotate that longer. So, yeah. Thank you for uh, being here. I want to show you now the number one outside step so first so i'm making sure that i'm pointing my toe and also holding the pole like this here and the the holding for the pole is uh, instead of doing like this this but this so so this is the outside step So what I did was I kind of throw my outer leg and also pointing my toes. So, and then I will make the 360 degrees turn. And then once I reach my almost 360 degrees, then I will bend my knees like this. Okay. Bend. And still, I am still uh, pointing my toes and I will slowly just do like this then I can do it in the other side so. now the second step is the chair spin so the chair spin is I hold this as high as I can also pointing my toes and hold here so I kind of hold like this here and then once I start to spin I will kind of push my body uh, by pushing here like some okay again <laughs> All right, so I am still pointing my toes. So first I did the outside step and I want to do the chair spin. Now the third is called sun spin. Step. And then the second was the was the chair spin. Or this. And 
Now I will uh, show the sunspeak. It's also the same as I am holding here and then I can hold here too. And here's my inside leg. I also point my toes. And my outer leg here will also uh, be pointing straight and then pointing the toes. That was uh, that was easier. So the next is the frog spin. Uh, the frog spin is so I just turn the pole into spinning, so I can get more spin. So I can also uh, I hold it I hold it here and here, and then. What I'll do is just put my left leg here so I can uh, get a frog spin later on. So if you can notice, I am trying to put, I'm trying to meet my both feet like this or like something here. You can see this are meeting. So again, All right, so that was the frog spin. The next is the basic pole fly. So I, when it when it comes to your hand, it's either you can climb like this, or you put this here, in here, and then you can climb and so. On. So what I'll do is I'll put my 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 right foot first, like here, and I should remember always that my feet is pointed, my, my toes are pointed. So I have to do like this. And this pole can be really slippery, so I might as well just wipe it first. So the, this is the basic pole climb. So for me, it's easier actually that I use this one like here to, to have a support. Now this is the <laughs> the basic, so I'm spinning right now. So, so it's important that you actually uh, point your toes, and also my two knees. Now I'm trying to hug it together. So if you're the new beginner, it can really hurt. It's it it actually hurts. Uh, because you are trying to hug your skin uh, with the pole. And then, for me it's easier if I put my hand like this. So, so this is the basic climb. <laughs> so, let me do that again. So I'll just take advantage while I'm already at the top here. So what I do is, okay, I'm just doing the regular number four seat. So it's either I can do like this. So without my hands, I'm trying to get my grip through my skin with my thighs. This is hard work. <laughs> so yeah. So that I can try to spin. Later on, I can show you guys some of the steps. Like, do like this for some easy, but always make sure, always making sure that I am pointing my toes. And I guess that's for now for today. <laughs> so again, from the beginning, I did the outside step, which was like this. The second was uh, the chair spin and the song spin, what, which was a bit difficult for me at least.
And then uh, the frog speed. And the basic pole climb, which uh, when I did like this. All right. Thank you. And that was my more than 15 minutes of a little bit cardio. Bye. Guys, check out how flexible my daughter is. Thank you. I'm jealous. <laughs> There you go. This is how flexible my daughter is. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, outside step. Ah, uh, this is hard. No, I didn't. You, you did it right. Again. <laughs> Good job.